Good morning, Mark Shelton with Pro Hanger Supply. Gonna do a quick video demonstration for you today on the GAU 140. Um, this is the old model GAU 140. This is the before the new eyes have just come out. This is marked in centimeters, but we've got new versions of this coming out and they'll be marked in inches and it will also have a smaller meter uh, that's adaptable to the machine. But just wanted to kind of go over this today and show you some of the uses for this. As you can see today, uh, I'm going to be hanging a Seabrooks foil back grass. Now this is one of the few materials that I like to hang dry. Um, to me, it hangs better. I like to uh, table trim it. Uh, therefore, I've got my basswood table set up. Um, I like to take the edges off of there because they're usually pretty beat up the way they come. Um, get a better crisper edge. So I set up my basswood. I'm going to trim it. Um, but uh, since I'm hanging it dry, with most other grasses, I pull it through my machine and wet trim it um, after it's been pasted and had a little bit of time to expand. With these foil backs, uh, they seem to delaminate once they start getting wet uh, pretty quickly. And also they wrinkle real easy. Um, any kind of wrinkle, any kind of crease, uh, you know, leaves a mark in that foil. So I'm um, not real fond of that. So I find that it does better to paste the wall, dry hang on the foil back grass. So that's where my material dispenser comes in handy. Uh, as you can see, I've got this set up uh, off to the side of my table. I can load uh, these rolls onto my dispenser. Now this is the wide dispenser that handles the 54 inch materials. Um, but this comes in a shorter version, uh, 109, uh, that handles up to 42 inch goods. So I've got this set up. It's got a nice little shelf on it, uh, that I can use. Uh, it's got stand, folding legs and locking casters. Got little material cones that I can slide this into place to, uh, lock it into the, the roll into place. Not necessary uh, if I'm not using a strip cutter uh, that trims the edges. Um, if I'm just pulling it through for measurement, um, pretty good. So uh, this is a real handy way of pulling out my material. Uh, I'm gonna pull, I'm gonna get two drops off of each roll. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pull two drops, trim them, and you know, I usually don't hang uh, you know, I mix my sequences, I, you know, hang my panels from different rolls on each. So that way, if I have any shading, it's consistently shaded, uh, which, you know, grass cloth could be like that. So I'll go ahead, pull my two rolls, trim them, pull another two rolls, trim them, and then hang those four, and then, you know, back and forth. But it's real quick, real easy uh, way of doing that. So I'll just show you real quick. I've got this. I can even do it one-handed, maybe. Uh, so just pull this stuff through. It's measuring as I pull it through, I need panels are 123 inches, so I'm not gonna try and do all that one-handed. Uh, but then there's a nice little edge here that's just enough room in between the shelf and the material dispenser to be able to run my knife, cut my panels off, take it over to my table and trim it. Um, quick and easy, nice and neat, low, uh, small footprint, doesn't take up a lot of space, and um, just a good way of getting things done and getting them done fast, get me back on the wall where I make my money. Mark Shelton, Pro Hanger Supply, www.prohangersupply. Look us up. Thank you for your time.